Okay, girls, I need you guys to get up. Good one, Mom. It's Saturday. We're not going to get up. We get to sleep in. I know it's Saturday, but I have a surprise for you guys. Hurry and get up and get dressed and come downstairs. Did somebody say surprise? I love surprises. Gotta go see what the surprise is all about, if you know what I mean. Hey, Mom. Good morning. Hi, Sparkles. So what's the surprise? Well, I have to wait till all your sisters are awake to tell you. Oh, okay. You cutie! Harper! Wake up! <laughs> okay, Mom, they'll be up in any second. Ugh, what is Sparkles' problem? I'm just over here trying to catch up on my snoozes. Guess that won't be happening. Hey, cutie, you should probably get up and come downstairs with me. Apparently, Mom has a surprise for us, so hurry up and get ready. Seriously? Oh, okay. What could be so important? Hmm, what to wear today? I've got no idea. Oh, that's right. I'll wear the huge. All right, time to go downstairs and see what all the ruckus is about. All right, Mom, we're all here. What surprise did you want to tell us? All right, girls. Well, your dad and I are going to go shopping. You know, do the usual Saturday grocery shopping. And uh, I thought it'd be a perfect test run to have Nikki come over, your new babysitter, and see how that goes. What? Our Saturday? We're getting babysat? Aw, oh, man. You're ruining our Saturday, Mom. Harper, don't say that. That's not nice. Your mother and I are not ruining your Saturday. We're actually trying to make sure that Nikki is a good fit. So, since we'll only be gone an hour, it'll be a good test run to see if she's a good fit for you guys. Sounds like a bunch of baloney. You mean balagna? No, I mean baloney. Judy, what is balagna? Well, if you see how baloney is spelled, it, it would, it's spelled like balagna. Well, that's really weird. How do you spell baloney? Oh, you spell it um B-O-L-O-G-N-A. True story, man. It's how you spell it. It's weird, huh? Yeah, that is really weird. Anyways. All right, girls. I want you to be very respectful and nice to Nikki. Give her a good shot, okay, of being uh, your babysitter. Oh, great. I think that was the doorbell. Our lives are over. Come on in, Nikki. The door is open. Well, hello, everyone. My name is Nikki. I'm so honored to be here today. And we're honored to have you here, Nikki. Oh, thank you so much. What's in the backpack, Nikki? Oh, this huge orange backpack I'm wearing? Oh, silly. This is my babysitting backpack. It's full of magical goodies and surprises. I'm growing very suspicious. We are going to have so much fun, you guys. Nikki, do you remember all of their names? I know I mentioned them on the phone the other day, but I can go through them again. Oh, Barbie, that's one of the things I take pride in. I always remember all of the kids' names that I babysit. We've got Harper, Cutie, and Sparkles. Whoa, creepy. She does know our names. Yep, that's my name. All right, uh, well, we shouldn't be gone long. We'll probably be an hour. Mom, huh? Dad, you can't seriously be leaving us with Nikki. Sparkles, don't worry. Just be polite. It's only going to be an hour. It'll be just fine. Trust me. Hey, cutie, we can go in the closet in our bedroom and hide in there until Mom and Dad get back. Are you in? Oh, yeah. I'm all in. Okay, let's go. I'll be you there. Cutie, Sparkles, where are you girls going? Come back over here. Oh man, we got caught, Harper. Sure did. Where were you girls going, huh? Uh, we were going to go hide in the closet until you guys got back. Because we don't want you guys to leave us. Oh, attachment issues. I see this a lot in kids. Especially when the parents are always home and never leave them. It'll be just fine, girls. We seriously need to go. Okay, we'll see you guys in about an hour. Bye. No, you can't leave us. Our lives are over. No. Thank you again so much, Nikki. We'll be back in about an hour. Help yourself to the fridge. Okay, thank you. See you guys later. I feel defeated. Me too, cutie. Me three. Um, you guys... What sparkles? She's just staring at us. I feel like I should say something. This is awkward. Ooh, I know what to say to her. Are you or are you not related to Ick? I mean, Vicky. Oh, Vicky? Yeah, we're cousins. That's just fabulous. Hey, that's what we thought. Are you anything like Vicky? Um, Personality-wise, no, not really. Okay. Well, do you guys hang out with each other ever? Like, at all? No, silly. We don't... 
Well, to tell you the truth, we don't exactly get along. <laughs> that could be a good thing. Yeah, why don't you guys get along at all your cousins? Well, Vicky is, um, let's see, a little boring. Boring? Vicky is evil! She's not boring, she's a horrible person. Yeah, she's not that good at babysitting. She doesn't like to do a lot of stuff, and, uh, basically, she thinks I'm, she calls me crazy and annoying. I don't know why, because I just love life. I love, like, doing different things and exploring and just having fun. So, yeah, she's not like that at all. We don't get along whatsoever. Oh, this could get interesting. All right, so shall we start our babysitting session? Who wants to color? Um, we're not like babies. We we don't really find f uh, fun in coloring. We'd rather like watch some TV or something. Oh, you silly girls, we gotta do something. If you just watch TV all day, your brains will fry. Well, they haven't yet. And all in good time. All right, you fun girls, let's see what I have in my babysitting backpack today. How about we not? Ripper, we still have to give her a chance. Be nice. All right, time to get serious. I gotta put my hair up in a ponytail. Much better. <laughs> you call that better? <laughs> Arlo, Arlo. <laughs> Why are you guys laughing? And what does R-O-F-L mean? It means rolling on the floor laughing. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Anyways, let's uh, get into the backpack. Okay, so we've got the crib, and the high chair, a rattle, a bottle, and a toilet, a cute little lion toy, toothbrush and toothpaste, and a sink with toilet paper on it. Perfect! Um, why do you have all this stuff, Nikki? So that I can be the best babysitter possible, ha! <laughs> but we, like, already have all this stuff. We have a toilet, and beds, and a sink, and food, and toothbrush and toothpaste. Yeah, the toothbrush and toothpaste are for me. Oh. Okay, do you have to brush every time after you eat? No, it's just for in case I have to spend the night and sleep over. Sometimes parents get stuck in a situation to where they can't make it home and then I am the most amazing babysitter. So I spend the night and watch the kids that I've been watching. Oh. Well, should we get started? Started with what? I take that as a yes. Um, Sparkles, I think you need a nap, so I'd like you to get in this crib. Um... Out of uh, Harper and Cutie, which one of you is the hungriest? I'm hungry to get out of here. Okay then, Cutie, I will have you in the high chair, and then Harper, we will be working on potty training with you. Whoa, this just got really weird. Well, I wasn't done uh, sleeping in on my Saturday, so I'm gonna go take a nap. Hey, this is actually kinda nice. Cutie, in the high chair, please. And Harper, I need you by the toilet. Ugh, okay. Okay, Sparkles, here's a bottle and a rattle for you. Have a good nap. Judy, you'll be eating cereal. There's your bowl and the cereal. Help yourself. All right, Harper, and for you, let's learn some potty training rules. Uh, yeah, no, thank you. I already know how to go potty, so I am not comfortable with learning more about potty. So, um, I'm good. I'm going to go upstairs in my room and lay down. Uh, no, you're not. I'm babysitting you, and you have to do what I tell you. No, I don't. You're not the boss of me, so yeah. I am when your parents are gone. Yeah, you're watching us, but you're not the boss of us. Fine, go upstairs. You're in trouble. Girl, you are weird. Cutie, Sparkles, you guys want to come upstairs in our room with me? Sure thing. Yeah, this crib isn't as comfy as I thought it'd be. No, you guys can't go into your bedroom. You have to stay here, Cutie and Sparkles. You have to stay with me. I'm watching you. Sweet, come on, sisters. Ugh, kids! Yeah, you guys, I don't know how I feel about Nikki. I was really actually trying to be a little bit open with having her be the new babysitter, because anyone's better than Icky Vicky. But I think Licky Nikki is just as bad in a different way. Yeah, I tried to give her a chance too, cutie. She is pretty weird. I was kind of excited that she had a babysitting backpack until she took out, like, all the... The, I don't know, the crib and the high chair and the potty, that was that was a little overboard. Yeah, agreed. I expect you girls to come down here this instant. Well, if you're expecting something unrealistic, you're always going to be unhappy. Sorry, Mickey. What do we do, you guys? She's, like, really weird, and I feel trapped. Mom and Dad aren't even here yet. You guys, I have an idea. What's your ever-so-great idea, Harper? I know how we could get a hold of Mom and Dad. I know where a cell phone is. Well, let's call them. Okay. Hey guys, I'm calling. I hope they answer. I hope so too. 
Oh, this looks like one of the girls calling us. Hello? Hey, Mom, this is Harper. And Sparkles! And Katie! We're calling to let you know that Nikki is a really weird babysitter and we're being serious. We tried to give her a chance, but she's just... We're up in our room right now. Are you guys going to be home soon? Yeah, we'll be home in just a minute. Pulling in right now, Harper. Don't worry. Yeah, we're pulling in front of the house right now. We'll be walking in in just a second. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Whew. How are you guys? Mom and Dad said they'll be here in just a second. They're pulling up to the house right now. Hi, Vicky. Um, what's up with all this stuff? The toilet, the high chair, the crib... Um, is this what you normally do when you babysit? Yeah, I bring the fundamentals. All right, well, uh, how did everything go? Not as planned, <laughs> but, uh, it was pretty okay. Now, how much were you going to pay me for this hour of babysitting? Um, let's ask our girls real quick. No, they don't have money to pay me. You guys said you were going to pay me really well for this hour because it's Saturday. So, if you pay me, I'll, I'll get out of your hair. I'll leave. Sparkles, Harper, Cutie, come downstairs. Ah, I think that was Mother's angelic voice. They're back. I'm not going to die in here after all. Come on, guys. All right, how was it, girls? Was uh, it a good babysitting session? Nope, it was absolutely horrible. Yeah, the worst. All right, Nikki, we'll pay you $10 for the hour. Oh, okay. Sounds great. Ha, I'll get out of your hair. Thanks. <laughs> Can we please find a different babysitter? We just did not like Nikki at all. She was really kind of weird. And she made me sit in the high chair. Yeah, and she was going to teach me how to go potty again. I already am potty trained, so I didn't want to do that. So I went up in my room. I do have to say, girls, that I am very proud of you for finding that cell phone, even though it was hidden. But I'm glad that you guys thought to call me and your dad. That was a very smart move. I'm glad you guys let us know what was going on. Yeah, that was my idea. That's one very cool thing about cell phones and how we can use them for our benefit and for our own safety. Yeah, we can definitely see that now. Can we find a different babysitter? Yes, definitely, Sparkles. I don't see why not. The fact that I'm going to have to be working and, and leaving you guys, I want to feel comfortable and I want you guys to enjoy and love who I have babysit you guys. Yep, I agree. It's definitely important that both me, your mom, and you girls are happy with who is babysitting you guys. I agree. All right, well, we'll keep a lookout for a new babysitter. Yay! Bang! Woo, we just dodged a bullet.